Welcome to the Pixel Kitchen Podcast, where we talk about anything on our minds over breakfast, lunch, dinner, honestly, anytime we feel like eating. I'm your host, Mac. With me is my co-host, Jared. What's up, dude? <laughs> uh, it's... Fuck it. We've missed what? Two weeks two now? Half th- Probably. I don't know. Let's go see when the last one was well, if it's if it's every if it's every two weeks, then we only missed one week, right? We only missed one upload? Maybe? Our last upload was June 25th. We go from there. One. Two. Yeah, we've... It should have been up last week. So we basically just pushed it a week. Like we did for uh, the Final Shape podcast. <clears throat> So what have you been up to? On a vacation. Got to meet some of my homies. Nice. Uh, we went to an Airbnb. Went to Anime Expo. Took them to the aquarium. Took them to the ocean. Went to some Anime Expo. Had a good time. Lots of fun. Fell down some stairs. <laughs> went to Anime Expo. Yeah. How was Anime Expo? Overall good. Um... Just Saturday wasn't a good day for me, and then I didn't go on Sunday. Just we spent the rest of the time just like wandering. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, thanks for asking. Yeah. What'd you buy? I don't remember if we actually talked about that out of, outside of this. Because you said you'd I have a bag right underneath <laughs> me that's got most of the stuff, but it's, it's a lot of prints of bunny girls. <laughs> that I like. I got two Gundams. I've got the real grade um uh God Gundam. Nice. Uh, Gundam. Yeah, and then I have a Exia that is black and purple. Nice. And it looks kind of sick. Yeah. And then I got this that I was gonna show you. I don't know if it's gonna show up. Uh, Red Panda Backpack, or Bag? Red Panda Backpack. Nice. And it's huge. It's got lots of space. (laughs) Love that for you. Guessing that's your work bag. You just carry it with you to work. Yeah, that's kind of what it's becoming. That's awesome. Yeah, thanks. Um, But yeah. I I also got uh, orange cat ears. Yeah. Couldn't find orange bunny ears? Nope. That's unlucky. Yeah. But, cat ears will do. It's the cats or the bunnies with you. One significantly beats out the other, but the other one will do in a pinch. Pincher. Hardly even know more. I wonder how many times it's going to happen on this podcast. If I remember, I I'll put a counter Probably up. not that many. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to, I can send you a picture of the backpack so it could actually pop up instead of just being what it was like. Yeah, I we'll can do take that. a picture of my haul, too. Yeah. As long as none of it's uh, not safe for work. I did get not safe for work things, but I won't include it in the thing. Okay. You can include them, but edit the picture and just fucking put like a square on it and just put NSFW. <laughs> like set all the not safe for work <laughs> stuff off to the side. There we go. Yeah, it'll work out like that. And you luckily didn't break the bank, like you said. You didn't go over your the amount you wanted to spend. Yeah. <clears throat> not many people do that. <laughs> yeah. I typically don't do that, but it's cool that I was able to, you know. Yeah, absolutely. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Um, and then I've been playing for games at least a little bit. Of Destiny, yep. uh, Weathering Waves, Genshin yep. Impact, yep. Nikkei, yep. Beach Girls, yep. um. 
Rage Goddess Stoke Upon Kingdom. So I've been yep. playing that too. Yep. Um, Rage being T, as though. in the last podcast. You've been wanting to play Borderlands? Well, the guy that I was with uh, this at Anime Expo, his favorite like game series is Borderlands. So I talked about Borderlands with him for a couple like a couple of days on and off. So yeah. I'm down to start. You got them ah, all. I just don't have DLC yeah. for three. And I just gotta have the room to play them. That's right. Did you order the Dog fucking... Room. That's no, not yet. I gotta wait till yeah. uh, Wednesday. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, I'll remind you. What about you, Mac? What have you been up to? Kind of actually keeping the schedule up on stream. Besides awesome. I love to hear that. my internet uh, fighting me every chance it gets. Yeah. <clears throat> You've been there for a couple streams. It it just hasn't gone great some, t- some streams. I'll go for an hour and then my internet will just be telling me, no, 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 no. You either play game or you stream. Because I crashed from Destiny, and the stream was fine after that. That's weird. Yeah. And then I... You know what? Say fuck it and stop what? stream, and then... Uh, Destiny in every game works perfectly fine. Yeah. Great. Say what you can say now? What's up? I was gonna say... Um, you know what was fun was uh, playing Phasmophobia on stream. Good time. Yeah. Besides that one fucking ghost taking <laughs> the first one, an hour. Yeah. Yeah. I think I think we were legitimately that first game. We were there for thirty to forty minutes, waiting on that it ghost. To that Mr. Do Voldemort anything. decided he wasn't gonna play after that one. I don't know why. Maybe he just got bored, or who knows? Yeah. He's probably not uh, doing uh, great. Yeah, it, it wasn't a bad stream. Yeah. He's not doing very great right now. Yeah. And I stream too. Yeah. Hopefully we can get you back in your schedule. Not this Tuesday. <laughs> well, hopefully we can get you back in the schedule of trying to stream at least once a week. Yes. <clears throat> I definitely think I'll be able to do uh, Wednesday. Do you have I'm D&D, guessing, but I was about to say, I'm um, guessing after D&D. Or before, that's what I was going to say, because I'll probably be up around... I've been wait. I gotta wake up at like 6.30 almost, or 6.45 this week, so I'll probably be up around the same time, just because, you know... Oh yeah, Wednesday's things. your day off, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, hi. That, that'll work out, that might fix my fucking schedule if I have someone to actually... Help keep me awake. What do you mean? Oh, my schedule is so fucked. I've been up around 8 to 9 a.m. And then my body goes, it's it's time. It's time. You're going to sleep. Whether you like it or not. Oh, so like. And then I sleep for an hour or two in my chair. Wake up in fucking pain. So I'm like, god damn it. And I hobble my ass to bed. Little hobble like a little hobbit. No, it's like the granny that ha- that has to use the walker, but moves two centimeters at a time. Yeah, I know that one. Yeah. And she's That's always doing head. it across the street. Yeah, hey, check it out, funny girl. Nice. And if you touch her, she gets pissed off. No, 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 <laughs> I can handle it myself. It, exactly. That, that the exact, yep. Mm-hmm. I've been trying to fucking edit. Da Vinci hasn't been liking... A pinky? <laughs> yeah. It hasn't been liking my fucking computer. And I think it's because I updated my graphics drivers again, and it just isn't... What a... Like, the AMD update just isn't working with Da Vinci. So I, I recently rolled them back. Haven't tried Da Vinci yet. But it fixed my uh, audio issue I was talking about with my TV. I can now That's listen good. to things without my headset. Except, I can't really not have my headset on because my glasses fall off now. 
Because there's no tension. Why? Because they broke. Oh, when did they break? I told you about this. Yeah, I'm sure you did, but I don't remember right now. Off the top uh, of my head. When did they break? I can't remember the exact day, but it was sometime last week. I'd have to go through our chat. But I've been sending you a lot of memes through Discord. But it was that day that was just absolute shit for me. And then... It was that last uh, it Dark off. Souls. It was my last Dark Souls stream. Oh, okay. Because you hopped in... joined yeah. in at the very end. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you hopped in and I was, right when I was ending stream because I was not having a fun time on Dark Souls. It was not the day to play it. <clears throat> Hoping I can get a decent day to play it this week. Yeah, definitely. It all depends on the storm that's coming in tonight. At the storm. Supposed to be big. It's gonna be big. I can hope not. How was that? Well, the rain got pushed back to 2 a.m. instead of 1 a.m. And 1 a.m. Okay. is just thunder. Okay. Holy fuck, that's a lot of red. <laughs> that's a lot. That's a lot of damage. Uh, let me check the radar here. But yeah, no, it's just... Glasses broke, and with how they broke, you know, right where the fucking... Your glasses fold in, right there. There's no tension on my head anymore, so they just slide off. Damn. That is so without my headset on, pinching them to hold them, I, I'm fucked. And lately, my head has been pissing me the fuck off. It's just so uncomfortable. Don't blame me. Yeah, I, I don't think this headset does it. But I used to have headsets that like really hurt the top of my ears after a while. That's most likely because the fucking cups didn't fake your ears properly, so they're just kind of pinching yeah. it. Definitely. Luckily enough, mine fit my head and they're comfortable to wear. It's just I went to wash my fucking ear cups and listen to exactly what the fuck Razor says to do when washing these things, and it fucking apparently was the wrong thing to do. Because now, you know, that gel that's inside of that cooling gel is just coming out. And it's mixing with my sweat. Mm. So it is gross. And I don't have the money to buy new fucking ear cups. Yeah. That's, that's not good. No. No. You gotta deal with what you gotta deal with. It's pain. Very true. <laughs> it sucks. God damn it, Razor. Yeah, no, I've been, like I said, I've been trying to blah, fucking blah, blah, blah. add it, but DaVinci just hasn't been liking my computer, and I think it's the fucking update. I'm going to be trying uh, either later tonight, mm -hmm. because I don't think I'm going to be sleeping again, so whenever we just, everyone decides to get off, I'll probably try it then. It won't okay. be, it most, it won't be our final shape playthrough, because for some fucking reason, anytime I try to edit that, I get through about 20 to 30 minutes, I'm like, I can't, I can't do this. My brain's just telling me to fucking do something else. You just get bored? I don't know. I, it could be bored. It could just be my brain just locks on. I'm going to try to, because uh, I was editing our, a, was it Warlords or Ghosts of the Deep? It was one of the two, like, dungeon runs we did. I think it was your first Warlords. Okay. I think I'm going to finish that because uh, my brain might be fixated on finishing what I started. Hey, Halo 3. Nice fight. Yeah. I haven't done a playthrough of Halo this year yet. Oh, this is a plenty of time. Especially your birthday. Yeah. Yeah. Always uh, 24 hour stream of Halos. Yeah, if a fucking 24-hour stream can happen this year. Probably not, but, you know, we'll see. Yeah. Ah. 
But besides, you know, trying to do things, I started Dark Souls 3. I've done two streams. I beat Vort, and that's it. <laughs> that's the only boss? Yeah, I haven't, uh, well, besides, you know, the first introductory boss. Uh, I, honestly, I don't remember the bosses in Dark Souls 3 too much. Uh, you have that first night at the beginning that turns into a goo monster. Oh, cool. Then you have Vort, which is the bit, which is the, on all fours with a big ice mallet. Well, not ice mallet, but he's got ice breath and speedy. Yeah, I saw you. I saw you fight for it. It's the dog, right? Yeah, yeah. And then I went after the tree. I got real close with the tree, but it just it was not that it was not that day to play that game. I do remember the tree. And then Dark Souls one and Dark Souls three kind of mold together in my head. Kinda. And anyone fucking saying, well, just get good. I'm trying to fucking get good at the fucking game. That's the point. I just don't want to get insanely fucking irritated when I'm already not having a good time outside of the game. Yeah, you don't need to be playing a game you're not having a good time with. If you're not having a good time with, to not have a good time with them. Not having a good time. Having a bad time. Having a bad time. That's what my brain feels like some days. Yeah, that's right. Just suck on repeat know. and then just instantly switch. It's fucking ugh. But been playing Destiny, obviously. Always Destiny. Playing some Valorant with T and Jess and them. Dumb. And now Jess is just fucking somewhere else, so probably won't be playing Val with her for a little while. Where did Jess go? I guess uh, I don't want to talk about it on stream. I don't know. Yeah. I can message it to you. Okay. But how have you been enjoying your Val? I don't mind it. Don't get me wrong. I'm... Because of the competitive nature of my dumbass, I still get angry at stupid teammates. Especially because, you know, they're like, let me just ride your ass so I body block you and you can't back away or do anything to get out of a fucking scenario where it's, oh, all three of them peeked me, let me turn the fuck around and run so I just get held in place. And I'm not playing duelist where they have abilities to fucking get out of the scenario quickly. I'm playing smokes. I'm playing fucking uh, fade. I don't know if you remember any of the characters. I don't know. Okay. But, you I, know, I, I play Brim. Play kind of hot. Yeah. Because Brim's like the quintessential, like, oh, smokes? I got him. How many smokes you got? A lot. Well, he's got three. And his doesn't recharge like others. Uh, I've been trying Clove, which is new smokes, but Jess has also been playing Clove because that's the entirety of what Clove is is Jess's theme. Okay. If you if you've seen how Clove is like her aesthetic and everything, you'd understand. I've not. You should look it up. <clears throat> okay. Oh well. Yeah. Yeah. No. I've been enjoying it. Been having some rough games, but been seeing improvement and then you know just the uh brain going hey we're improving at a game let's relax a little bit and just shit the bed classic, classic. Amber Heard. you mean amber turd yeah, exactly yeah no it... and tomorrow if the plan works out me and tia grinding out ranked Wow. Look at you. I, yeah. Well, it, technically, tomorrow would be today for this upload. Okay. Hey, yeah. See if uh, Max live. Go check him out. It. You know, fuck it. I'll see if I can get the. I'll. Because I'll have this uploaded tonight. Because I'll probably fucking get this edited tonight and then get it uploaded. I can. 
hit go live. When I, uh, I, yeah, I can put this live as soon as I go live. Gotta remind myself there to do go. that. <laughs> yeah. Brain. But yeah, no, that's really all I've been up to is just fucking some games losing my mind. And, uh, so some? Yeah. Yeah, some games. And say so I was losing my mind some. I said I was losing my mind and playing some games. Right. Yeah. Just some of the games, or? Yeah, just all some of the games. games. I don't have all games. I can't play all games. I can only play some games. Wow. Rare. That's right. Oh. Yeah. What do we want to start first, Jared? What What do we want to hit first? Do we want to... Uh, mouse, please? I think we could talk about Bunny. The First Descendant? Yeah. So a game you haven't tried yet? Correct. But you have, and what was your uh, thoughts about it when you tried it? I didn't mind it, but... You know, Shmopanese man himself was playing it, too. Yeah, Shmopak knees, Melvin. I didn't mind it. Like, I can see the appeal for some people, but it's also, for me, it just... I'm gonna say this, and people are gonna be like, well, you didn't play enough to get to the fucking hard parts of the game. The early bits felt way too fucking easy to hold me solo. Mm -hmm. So if I play the game anymore, it's gotta, like, I gotta be playing with someone. If I'm just gonna blow through everything, it's pointless. It's like when we used to talk to Tom about, like, fucking uh, playing Minecraft and everything with just cheating, like, adding cheats and everything. It just defeats the purpose of playing. Yeah. Because if you're just going to give yourself to things or blow through the game, it's like, I don't enjoy that. And to any of you fuckers that are going to sit there and tell me I play Strand Titan and go, well, you're just blowing through the game anyway. Hey, I've already beat Destiny. Yeah, that's I can right. blow we through can it now. We can, we can uh, turn it off now. Not how that works. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. Dude, we still haven't played I... fucking the raids. We still haven't done the raid. We can't turn it off yet. But we already beat the game. Why do we need the raids? Because we enjoy Destiny still. Wow. Yeah. Foggers. <laughs> yeah. No, the joke I was going for is the fact that Strain Titan is just the like the easy mode of Destiny. Right. <clears throat> but I play that just because that's the only fucking because I at this point I'm stuck doing Strain Titan until the people I play with play more and get their fucking light level up. What do you mean? Get your pinnacles. I know, but why are you stuck playing it because of that? Because if we do GMs or anything, I'm the highest light level. Yeah. So I bring you guys up with me. I know, but in the mm -hmm. meantime, you don't have to be playing Strand. And I don't. I've been trying, like, I've been playing, like, the Void and Prismatic and shit. Oh, yeah. Like, for Iron Banner, I have a Prismatic build. Hoggers, do you like it? Yeah. I mean, it's just Peregrine, so I'm just fucking one-shotting with my knee. My melee. It works, I'm and so then funny. it's, I enjoy it, but it's also shit to do in the current meta until Bungie nerfs the goddamn grenade, the smoke grenade from Hunters. What's wrong with it? I'm going for my melee, because you know I got to sprint and actually jump in the air and hit. Mm-hmm. There's three motherfucking goddamn smoke grenades between me and the person, and we're five feet away. One pops, I'm wow, slow. Another pops, I'm slow. A third pops, I'm still slow. I'm just standing there like, kill me. Fucking kill me. I don't want to be here anymore. Well, it, wouldn't that happen with, like, any void? 
thingy. No, not all of them slow. One silences. But it's also not just that issue. Like, then you have, like, the fucking... I don't have an issue with Threaded Spectre. Mm -hmm. I have an issue of getting a hunter down to one tap and then dodging and instantly full health. I don't know how that works, but I'm curious. So am I, because I've played Hunter, and I don't get full health when I dodge, and I've played with fucking Worm Husk. We got on fucking Destiny talk when we were trying to fucking talk about First Descendant. What's that? God damn it, Jen. <laughs> got your favorite type of woman in it. Funny. Yeah. There you go. Uh, okay. Looks like looks like uh, Nexon actually talked about this. Nexon about Games what? denied accusation of asset theft from Destiny Two, promising to change similar icons in the first Descendant. Game face criticism for bugs, microtransactions, and art assets resembling Destiny Two, leading to necessary changes. Look at that! Huh. They actually talked about it. Can't believe they denied it when it's so obvious. Yeah, and then I will put the. I'll put an icon like I'll put the thing here, that. I just put Paul Tassie's tweet here showing it. That way you know exactly who the fuck tweeted out. Yeah. Which I will grab this link and I will post it in the doc. I don't know who Paul Tassie is. Uh. <sighs> He writes for Forbes, I think. Yeah, I write about games and TV for Forbes. Yeah. So, games journalist and TV journalist. But you can look at, like, the things here. Some are, in my opinion, changed enough. Others, no. Those are the exact fucking same. Yeah. Like, there's one here with, uh... That's just a hand. Right. And like a general open motion. I feel like that one's changed enough. You are completely gone. <laughs> I know. Like when I move my arm for some reason, it just decides I'm not there. <laughs> so whenever I go to scratch an itch or anything. Yeah. 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 And then you have uh, explosive payload. Oh, instead of a circle right, behind it, it's a triangle. Oh. Or it's a hexagon. Or outlaw. They build in the... Th fourth circle, and added mobility behind it. Wow. I posted the link in the doc, so you can look at it too if you want. Well, I know what all of the icons were that was by Travis. Yeah. So, like, I, everything that you're talking about, I, I know in my head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. There was also the assets of weapons too, I believe. Yeah, there was a fucking Ikello skin. Yeah. There was like a fucking... What the... What is it called? I'm gone. <laughs> what is the linear fusion called? Jared, help. <laughs> For what? Type in? It's... No. Exotic. Okay, I need a little bit more. Exotic linear fusion. I need a little bit more. Micro castle? Nope. That's the trace rifle. Uh, super simulator. There you go. It's that. It looks exactly fucking like that. Right on. That's just. But it's a sniper. Lasers. And that's just a skin. That's just a skin in first ascendant. Not good. It's not. not good luck, y'all. So it really isn't. On pay, pay gates, everything. They do pay gate everything, but so far, I'm going to actually give it to them on this one. So far, everything you can just grind. I don't know about like weapon skins or anything like that, because I haven't played enough to look at, like, I didn't look at the shop or anything. Mm -hmm. But for people, you can just play the game. It's a fucking grind. 
but you can just play the game. So that I I do like that. I won't sit here and say that it's shit because it's got microtransactions in it if you can fully just grind out everything. Right. Oh, that guy paid for it? Cool. I'll just go play I'll just go play the game I enjoy. But the problem is how much how long it takes to grind stuff. Like you you know um you remember Black Desert Online? Oh yeah, no, I fully understand that. That I'm not saying things don't need to be changed. Yeah. Yeah, fucking BDO was, uh... Me and Melvin were playing that for a bit, and it just... It became a problem. Because he played a lot of it. I I really like the game, but... The issue with the game is... Impossible to navigate around. Yeah. Yep. I like the uh other one we played. Uh Blaine Soul? Yes. Yeah, Blaine Soul was fun too. I liked it a lot as well. Of all the, uh, all the classes did feel a bit different. Yeah. Of all like the MMOs we've tried as a group, that's the one I enjoyed the most. But it was never a fucking I could play that solo type shit. Let's see. Their My favorite MMO solo. has either got to go to ESO or uh, Final Fantasy. Yeah, I'm going to give it to a while. We didn't enjoy it as much. No, I didn't enjoy it as much. <clears throat> I feel that. WoW has so much clutter on the screen. I get that. But also, I think I'd have to give it to Final Fantasy because of the modding community. Valid. That's that's a good reason. Honestly, I'd give it just to Final Fantasy because it's not Bethesda. Yeah. And also, just to further honey the pot, um, the community of that game is so much better than any other like online community that I've seen at least. Mm-hmm. Like they are so ready to help new players instead of just like shitting on them. Yeah. I've seen both sides of that coin. There's a couple of people I used to follow on Twitter way fucking back in the day that I would see played Final Fantasy mm-hmm. online. And they would they wouldn't be the ones shit talking, but they would be they would show the fucking people that they were raiding with shit talking people that weren't doing enough. That sucks. Yeah. I feel like that well that's like kind of just bound to happen, but yeah. Oh definitely. It, it sucks. Which So I never had any issues uh yeah, yeah, with yeah, anyone in there. Uh, yeah, that's great. That's great. Exactly. But the uh elitist mindset of like DPS and shit for rating push put yeah. this into the next topic. Oh. Yeah. I had a good segue there, but you weren't done saying what you were saying, so it kinda didn't work out fully. Sorry. It it's it's on me. But yeah, no, uh it's the elitist mindset on what to use for DPS and Destiny. And it, it kind of works for every game. Mm-hmm. If if uh, certain things are just better with raids, but for the way I'm thinking about it, it works better for De- Destiny because everyone is kind of the same in Destiny. It's not a mass difference yeah. in other like MMO it's... type shit. Yeah. It's very, like, you've got three different classes, and you've yeah. got basically two different subclasses. <laughs> yeah. not, not, like, actually, but just, like, that's that's how the game is played. Yeah, that's about as close as what's fucking gonna get. 
because it's right now. Warlocks, you can either Nova, you could Well, or you can play Prismatic. And I don't know what they're using in Nova's Prismatic. Meta? It does a lot of damage right now. Hawk champ. Yeah. They should make a Celestial Nighthawk for Nova. <laughs> they need to do that with uh, Titan's new thing, too. They need to do it with Titan's bubble. Domain <laughs> expansion. Yeah, it just goes... It's the entire fucking DPS area now. And it, and if you're wearing the Helm of Saint-14, it fucking blinds everyone. Even That's the right. boss. But it only lasts for out so amount of time. It lasts for a, a, a insignificant amount of time. Like, it's very short. So you have that amount of time to either get to a safe spot or DPS. That might... We're cooking with something here. I don't know if it's <laughs> fire or crayons, but we're cooking with something. Nothing like crayons. That doesn't sound bad, though. No, it sounds like really a funny. complete give me the safety type situation. That'd be great for GMs. Like a good old just safety button. Basically, it's just going to be a different well. I don't yeah. want to be stuck in pl fucking playing Helm, though. Because it, it is only useful with Bubble. You're going to like Titan's new uh, Void better. The three axes. Yeah, the axes are really fun. Especially, like, when you're not the one making them. It's just kind of fun to pick up and throw them. Yeah. I enjoy that. I don't it's actually awesome know how PvP. much damage it is. Well... The first one hits, the second one I think weakens, if the first one doesn't, and then the third one just does more damage. So overall, you're okay. going to, by the end of it, you're weakening the fucking boss. So if, say, me and you and Sean go into a GM, and I'm playing that specific one, or Sean is playing it, and I do it, and then you, you'll have a weakened target to hit your uh, Nighthawk on. Right on. Yeah. That's one of the more reasons why I enjoy it. Which current current GM build for Titan is Void. That's cool. Because Peregrine can one shot champs. That's Again. the one shot knockback with the kick, right? Yeah, jump in the air and do the thing. Except with uh You have to be you have to have it. You gotta do things perfect to be able to one shot uh overload and like one shot any of them, honestly. Except yeah. unstop. Because even if you stun it, I've never one shot an unstop. Even perfect. Like had perfect fucking setup and everything. <clears throat> but fucking I unstop the, even I think when it was unstoppable rockets, Apex would uh one shot it. I think so. I was talking, like, specifically with the knee, though. Mm. Yeah, no, back to the elitist mindset for the DPS. The entire thought process behind this is the fact that people are shitting on anyone using Thunderlord. Here's the thing. Is it arc weak? Is it also machine gun? Why the fuck wouldn't you use Thunderlord? Why the fuck would you be like, you could only use bait and switch fucking goddamn grenade launcher. Because it's either Cataphract or the other one. The one that everyone had to fucking get. Edge Transit. Or if yeah. you're a fucking hunter, you can only use fucking Nighthawk and still hunt. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. I understand why to say it. But if we're doing dungeons... Or if we're doing fucking GMs or shit like that. We're not really on a fucking time schedule. We don't need to rush through it like a raid. Because I can fully get it with the raid. Because, yes, we are technically time crunched when we're fighting the boss. Because mm -hmm. every boss has that time gated type shit. Or right. not so much time gated, but more so... 
you do this too many times, you're fucked. Because with Golgoroth, you have the fucking the tablet. Yeah, the enrage mechanic and shit like that. Golgoroth, you have the tablet, it fills up, it just fucking, you just die. With the next one after that, the War Priest. Where the fuck it? I, th I think it's the War Priest. Yeah, you have the three fucking pillars. You have three chances to kill him. And Crota, yeah, if you, yeah, he, you just die. And then Crota, he has the in fucking. He was the beginning of the enrage mechanic, wasn't he? Uh, yeah. Because if I'm not no, mistaken, no, I think Atheon could enrage. Did, did Atheon enrage the kill? I think so, because I, I remember that the Templar can enrage as well. Are we talking like in D2 or D1? I don't actually remember which one. <laughs> um, I just... Because I don't remember it doing it in D1. I remember Crota doing it. Right. Classic you know, Crota. Yeah, you know some motherfucking bullshit? What? I haven't run a single fucking D2 raid. Uh, I've yeah. only run the, the fucking D1 reprisals. Yeah. And I've played D2 think, since day motherfucking one. I think the only D2 raid that I have run at all was the, Deep the one with the... Yeah. With Tannix. When Jesse was playing and we got Platini in and literally Platini was playing for a week and we got him through a raid. It's, it's insane that we were able to do that. Yeah, I wasn't able to play at that point in time. It's fucking sucks. Yeah, absolutely. But your dad said he wants eyes of tomorrow, so we might be able to fucking sneak in a I, DSC. The um the Scout Rifle from that is something I absolutely love, and I want to farm because it's something you can craft. Yeah, but you can craft other weapons in there. I got a a good roll for it, um, so I don't really need to craft it, but I just like Crafting it will make it better. The enhanced perks. Mm -hmm. The better. That's yeah, right. no, like, back, we went off point again. Uh, but the point of like the fucking the elitist mindset of what to use for DPS, not not everyone has to use the exact fucking same shit. Yes, no. would it be faster? Yeah, probably. Are you question? Are you running master raids twenty four fucking seven? And if so, why the fuck are you playing with someone new to the game? Because the consistency of the people I see talk shit about, oh, you're using the wrong shit for DPS, is to people new to the game or haven't fucking done raids and shit. Because there's a big fucking goddamn part of the community that hasn't done raids because they don't have a lot of people to play with. Right. So they can't do the hard shit. They can't do that. Like, like say for Jared, he wants to fucking use Borealis because of the new stuff coming out. That's right. I think it'll be fun. The only, the exact fucking thing I told him is, you can use it in everything, but if we're doing GMs, or if we're fucking failing on raids. Like, if we're failing too much, pull out fucking still hunt. Yep. <laughs> give, me, give me that extra DPS, we need it. <laughs> I mean, that type of shit. DPS is so insane. It, it's nuts, because it it's not because it works with fucking goddamn Nighthawk. Yeah. I think that exotic armor pieces that work with weapons are so cool. Like uh, Moth Keeper's Grasps with um, the uh, grenade launcher. That, yeah, that grenade launcher that spawns Moth. Yeah, like the fact that it works with that and spawns an additional Moth and it's just, it's really cool. Yeah. So I, I love stuff like that. It's it's awesome. So, I like Steel Hunt a lot, but it is just like, yeah, it's weird because there's nothing that you can substitute for that slot. If you're running Prismatic and you've 
or like solar you go celestial nighthawk because nothing else is really good right now for solar nope um not for boss dps or, yeah or you could do the um blade barrage with the the arms that give you how like the energy but they nerf that so it doesn't refund it as much mm -hmm. no, i fully get it and sadly with buck and hunters you either have nighthawk which people are going to tell you to use or you have orpheus or the chess piece that is basically going to do like both are going to do around the same thing for uh night stalker gear falcons, fucking, sort of yeah them. yeah gear falcons and orpheus are going to do the Around the same thing. Or you have RDMs, Radiant Dance Machines, with the fucking ham caimans. Radiant Dance Machines, funny. Yeah. It does good fucking damage. But it just, it, like, nothing beats out just running Still Hunt and Nighthawk. If for straight DPS. Nothing at all. I mean, still Hunt's getting, a, I think, a 25% nerf, but it's still... I don't think anything's going to push past that as a thing. And this is the exact fucking thing we're talking about with the elitist mindset on what to use for DPS. People are Even with it getting a nerf, people are going to be like, still fucking use it. Why are you doing anything else? Fuck, this is one of the... Like, this entire mindset's one of the reasons why we never did LFG for raids. Yeah. That in the few times we did do LFGs, we got that type of shit. We got dickheads. There was one time me and Tom did it for trials in D1. Uh huh. The person we played with was fine. We got lucky. We were bad yeah, at the game, was. and they were significant. They were better than us, so I think they were fucking irritated, but they didn't talk shit. They didn't get pissed off. They were. Fine. Yeah. Yeah. No, it's just the entire point of this goddamn talk was if you're not playing the hardest difficult shit, hardest difficulty of things, you don't need to min max every goddamn thing. Don't get me wrong. If someone's coming in there, I'm using Rat King and only Rat King for all my goddamn DPS, and no one else is running a fucking Rat King. They, they, you say it nicely. Please use something else. None of us are going to be using Rat King. You're going to do two fucking damage. Please. <laughs> It'd be but, fun to get a bunch of people using Yeah, Rat I get six people using fucking Rat King. <sighs> Jared, we got, we have, we have some dungeons to play through. Which ones? Me. Uh,. We have Are to there dragons in any of the dungeons? No. No dragons are in the dungeons. What? Fine. But I love dungeons and dragons so much. I mean, we need to re want run Warlords with your dad so we can get the fucking sidearm. And that one has dragons. It's Ahamkara's. That's true. But no, remember I was I was going to make a fucking all dungeons but funny video. Yeah. And we still have some we, to play we through. We did most of the dungeons, right? Yeah, we still have some to play through. And we had to play through, I think, one or two because uh, my mic got fucking muted in OBS. It was my mic or you guys got muted. Can't remember. It was your mic. Because <clears throat> I suggested, why don't you just go voice over it? It'll be funny. Did you suggest that? Yeah. It's been a while. I'm I I need to double check exactly because that was the fucking twelve hour stream. I said I'm just gonna go until I decide to stop. Mm -hmm. And the fucking Kaidel's dungeon fucking irritated the hell out of us. Oh yeah, because we were was, uh, not good, not fun. No, because we did the mechanic the way it's fucking supposed to be done, and it fucking killed us multiple times. And that midway point 
of uh go in, get the things, kill the fucking centurion that's outside, and you gotta do it four fucking times. Is so fucking slog heavy. You just gotta fucking just mindlessly power through it. Yeah. And it's irritating. And frustrating. Yeah. I still need the yeah, fucking weapon and that fucking thing. It's heart shadow. I think you got it when we did that dungeon. We did. Uh, I did, yeah. I was saying yeah. that I'm very blood line are the only exotic side of dungeons. Yeah. We only got two. And the person that needed buried bloodline didn't fucking get it. <laughs> But one of us did that did need the fucking exotic from Kaido did get it though, so that was good. But yeah, no, it just it's fine. It suck. A big suck. That dungeon suck, and we need to play through it, even just yes. for trying to get the fucking thing. And then for uh, Voldemort, we need to go through and get him the. Uh, Wish Ender. Wish Ender? I hardly even know her. There's two. <laughs> I'll just call it That's out right. instead of putting on a fucking timer. Uh, counter. Yeah, no. If you couldn't tell, we're done with the fucking DPS topic. We're just talking about shit now. We're just talking about talking. That's right. I don't get excited for that video. That's going to come out. We just need to play it. We just need to have time to where it's you, me, and Sean. So there's yeah. continuity between the entire video. And play through the fucking dungeons. I'll double check okay. which ones we need to go through. I know we need to go through the first two. Which is, which are both going to be extremely simple. Which is the one on the moon, and I think the one with Wish Ender. Because we didn't do those two on stream. Because there's what no... The, moon? Uh, the one you get Xenophage from, so we need to get that quest started for you. Oh, yeah. I think I had it started. That's good. Because I'm at the point where I need to play it. And do the thing. So when we do that, we'll... uh, Hopefully we can get you at that exact same spot. Okay. Yeah, 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 then we can just both end it with Xenophage. Because it's just... From what I've seen, it's do something in it, and then finish it, and then go talk to Eris Morn, and she just... Here's gun. Gun. Tab. Yeah. And Xenophage is good for a lot of things. It's not like, oh, here, DPS gun. No, it's like, here, specific gun for specific things. Because it's a hard-hitting... Uh, LMG. Yeah. It's uh, great for Gambit invading. Yeah. Because it'll two tap. Say, I think that, that thing just fucks me up on Gambit. It'll fucking two tap. <clears throat> yeah, no, I just like, look, forward, look forward to that video. Hopefully, look forward to because it's going to come out this week if I get it fucking done. The Warlord's Ruin video. That should have been out last year. <laughs> I think that's how long I've had it. I Oh boy. Me and editing just doesn't go well together at the moment. Just I haven't had a fun fucking last year and a half. Yeah, but you're you're and then that's what matters. Yeah. Surprisingly enough. Yeah. Let's push over to the last topic we got of Apex. Well, sorry, EA in killing Apex. Oh, yeah. If no one knows. Oh, mercy. Yeah. If no one knows, there will be a link in the description to the changes they're making to the Battle Pass. To my knowledge, they haven't walked these back at all. But I'm going to go through and just read some of the changes that they're doing. So now they're doing every half season, you're getting a 60 level 
Battle Pass. For the free points. one, yeah, for the free one, you get 200 coins, you get seven packs, you get a character skin, a weapon skin, a standing emote, and two times season rewards of free. Oh, no, sorry. It was it. Is that fucking? I don't know what the fuck that means, what it means here. But every thing you're getting with the free thing is epic. It's not legendary. The new, which is a ten dollars for sixty levels instead of a hundred and ten, like it used to be. Oh, you're now boy. getting thirteen hundred coins. That's the exact same. You can double the crafting materials. Ten exotic shards, which is the same. 17 packs, so three more, and three legend thematic packs, so 20 altogether. Two legendary character skins, which is the same. One legendary weapon, and one reactive weapon. So that's the same. You're not getting a reactive uh, a variant premium, premium. anymore, though. Then you have the premium plus. Ooh. The super Gives, super premium. Which is $20. For a half season. So this is $40 for the whole season. To get both battle passes. You get 60 levels. 10 level skips. 1300 coins. So it doesn't change. 2400 materials. Doesn't. So that doesn't change from regular premium. You get 20 exotic shards. Instead of 10. And then the same amount of packs. So 20 overall with 17 and three uh, thematic two legendary character skins ever like the skins Ugh. and the reactive one are the exact same but you get two premium plus legendary character skin variants and then all player all legends are playable which the all okay. legends being playable doesn't make sense for anyone who's playing the game say me and you jump back into it yeah, that wouldn't be a terrible option. I wouldn't fucking spend twenty dollars on fucking sixty level battle pass though, right? Because that's insane. But on the off chance we decide, hey, we're gonna hop on Apex, it wouldn't be the worst option because we don't have all the, we don't have all legends because we right. didn't play, we haven't played it consistently. But the people that are playing it consistently that would actually spend twenty dollars on a season pass don't need the legends. And hell, anyone who's playing cons this consistently plays like one to three fucking legends. Like they have their main and then a backup and then maybe a third backup just in case they're playing with random in trios that take two of their characters. That's rough, buddy. Yeah. It's happened to both of us. That has happened to both of us. But, yeah, it's the all playable during Battle Pass duration is pointless. For anyone that's actually legitimately going to look at that and go, I'll spend the $20. This is a stupid thing to fucking have. Yeah. It's like when fucking Blizzard went, we're putting the characters locked behind the Battle Pass. That was dumb. You're talking about Overwatch? Yeah. They recently changed that. Yeah. But the biggest gripe I have with this, it's not like the All Legends okay. playable, is you can't buy the Battle Pass with Apex coins. Nope. It's only fucking money. I have to spend money for it. So all this being able to just play the game and then actually grind it out from level one of the battle pass to level 10 to be able to level 100 <laughs> to be able to buy the next battle pass is gone because money yes servers cost fucking money but god damn it you have enough fucking people buying packs to get the goddamn heirloom skins you can eat my dick with a 10 dollar battle pass
blah, 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 blah. And, and then dropping it from 110 to just 60 for the exact same price. And there's no justification that's, that's in insane. here. Yeah, there's no justification in here to be like, it's worth it. No. It's basically the exact fucking same materials we were getting to begin with. Hello? Hello. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why they're doing that. They're it's EA. It's what fucking money grubbing. With their wallet. Exactly. They're, it's money grubbing cocks. Damn yeah, straight. It, it. Fuck. I enjoyed Apex when we did play it. It it yeah, was never a good. it was never a game I could play solo, but I enjoyed it. And then we stopped when we kept getting put in the fucking lobbies with people that are using the fucking stupid movement tech to uh, completely shit on people that are like, oh, let me take a break from this to go actually enjoy other games instead of mindlessly bash my head against the wall that is Apex. <laughs> yeah. That, that's what happened the first time we got back. Like, we played a match when we re-downloaded it. We got fucking yeah. swarmed by people that are goddamn better at the game. Don't get me wrong. I'm fine with getting shit on a game because they're better than us. That's what happens. But goddamn it, it shouldn't be the first game I come back to. <laughs> After eight months. You, you talk shit, you get slapped by the, the donkey dick. Whack. I can... And apparently they're having a significant hacker issue right now. So is that too significant? Um, two of their pro players got hacked during a fucking tournament. Oh, I remember this. Okay, so nothing new though. No. In regular games. People are getting a considerable number of hackers in them. So, yeah. Their anti-cheat just isn't catching them. I wonder what's going on with the anti-cheat. Uh, EA isn't fucking paying enough for a good one. Yeah, probably. Or it's like, or they just have the splash screen of we have this anti-cheat. It's it's the Jedi mind trick. It just we have this. But they don't have it. Give me your money. It's just it's what it is. It's all it is. That's just I, fuck fuck EA. Fuck this company. Absolutely. They took a goddamn good IP. Turned it into a good fucking battle royale, and then destroyed both of them. Unforgivable. I'm surprised you didn't have more to say about that because you enjoy Titanfall. I yeah, I really do enjoy Titanfall, and it just sucks that they decided mm. that it's uh, not a battle pass worthy battle royale that's gonna get them any money. But it's nice to see a uh, resurgence in the player base because maybe they'll bring some attention to it from the, this the baby twice makers. Before. Yeah, so probably not then. No, they're they're gonna I go. That there was a time where I was like, oh, maybe they're gonna reveal the the thingy. Titanfall um, three. Yeah, but that wasn't the reveal. They've hinted at adding a specific character from Titanfall into Apex for fucking, what, a year, two years now? I don't know, actually. Which character are you referring to? Jack Cooper, I think. I think that's who everyone oh. fucking talks about. I mean, that's like the main character, so. I can't remember the exact. Because, have, like, one of the I know exactly one of the characters 
is like fully ripped from Titanfall and put in its ash. And I think Valk is uh tied to Titanfall as well. Like her dad. Yeah, she's was her a dad pilot. was a pilot. Yeah. And then when I, fuck. Uh Bangalore's brother, when he got announced, they were fighting a pilot. That whole cutscene. So yeah, they they've been hinting at adding more things like lore wise, but they're not doing it anymore. I'm not seeing any more lore things or anything like that to beef it up. You know, like how fucking Fortnite was doing it. And one of the main reasons why it was so fucking big, because they were actually fleshing out a story in a battle royale. <laughs> and Apex just went, hey, we're doing this cool thing. And hey, 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 that cool thing we're doing is costing too much money. We need to pull it back, pull it back. Sounds about right. Fucking fuck you, EA. Quit killing things that are fun. If only. Bitches. Fucking bitches. They gotta just keep the head out of their wallet and just yeah. listen to what people are wanting. And unfortunately, like, that's just not what's happening. They're not gonna. EA's always been about the fucking money, and the community's just been like, we know what you want, and we're gonna give it to you. Because oh, maybe gonna... if we give it to you, you'll give us what we want. It's all, They're all just coping, and they're blowing money. I seen a video of someone like legitimately talking like it's all content creators legitimately talking about like the stupidity of this battle pass and what someone was like you don't have ten dollars for a fucking battle pass what are you talking about H having the money isn't a problem it's what they're doing to the game that's the problem the game guys it's dying we need you to go buy it for twenty dollars again and again Every season. These are the same people who look at the people who fucking buy Destiny shit and go, what the fuck are you talking about? You're worse than us. Fuck off. You're, you're an idiot. But am I a cute idiot? <laughs> sure, why not? That makes you Otters. feel better. Yeah. Always. Oh, the fucking the yeah. league. Right. The character. We're it? getting a new character. The bunny? Aurora? Yeah. Yeah, she looks so cute. At least that's what it looks like when you open league. That's what it signifies yeah, at least. She's coming out. She has a uh a uh, Mordecai's ult. Oh, cool. And then you have the Rek'Sai skin coming out too, don't you? Yep. Are you excited? I don't know. I like, I want to play League and I don't. It's just one of those things. I fully understand that. Going from not, I having not played League since the last time we played, and then mm -hmm. Ben playing only Destiny and Valorant. Playing it with T today, it felt so fucking insanely slow. Like, it just felt unbelievably like I was just... I was stuck in quicksand trying to just move forward, and I couldn't. That's what it felt like. It felt like I was just aging in real time. But I was watching it happen. I do, Jared. 
I could. I, what? You can't. I don't know what to play in fucking arenas. Because I pick people are like, oh, these should be fine. And then just get dumpstered. Because I. I don't know either. Fucking play them after I get shit on by them. And it does nothing when I do the exact fucking same shit the enemy did to me. It's bushy. I, that's why I don't like arenas that much. Yeah, sit or miss. I like it because, like, I like that it's a two-player thing. Yeah. I think you can hop in with more than just two. Well, I don't think you're I know, locked in and just point, running with two. I like that it is a two-player thing. Yeah, yeah. I mean, technically, everything's a two-player thing. I know, but you could just get in with your duo, and then you don't have to worry about anyone else. I don't, I don't know what you mean. Having to not worry about anybody else. Yeah, you do what to worry about. So I don't know what you mean by not worrying about anybody else. You do what to worry about. You keep going out. I don't know what you mean about not having to worry about anybody else. Because you got to worry about your duo. Yeah, like anybody else besides you too. But the enemy. I mean, that's not anything that you can ever affect. <laughs> you just got to be better than the enemy, right? But if you've got teammates not and wrong. they suck... Even if you're better than the enemy, they could still win because their teammates suck. Yeah, valid. Oh, weather changed again. What? Ooh, that's a lot of red coming. I see red on the horizon. Ah, that fucking sucks. Well, if it's just rain, and it's not a fuck ton of wind with it, here's hoping. Here's hoping. That's right. <laughs> here's to you, kid. Yeah. So I guess we will uh, cut this off here then, for uh, yeah. safety reasons. Unless you have something sure. very specific you want to say. Um... I don't think so. Okay. Thank you, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for joining us tonight as we discussed what was on our minds. I was your host, Mac. He was your co-host, Jared. Hi, y'all. Thanks for coming. Have a nice night. Bye. Uh.